So, thinking about our brave new world of capital. Capital rules everything around me, not money, 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 money. So, capital, cap, kaput, all the same word, cap head. Uh, the notion of capital, like, you think about the traditionally, what, hectocomb, think about the Iliad, right? It's a hundred, a hundred head of oxen, uh, kind of an expensive thing. And the basic idea is if you respected the gods, you would actually uh, do real monetary sacrifices. So even in today's world, let us assume that, you know, a single ox is like a thousand bucks. So can you imagine having a, th a hundred oxen, like a hundred thousand dollars, you know, essentially the price of a cyber truck? Um, to appease the gods, kind of, uh, kind of expensive, right? So the reason why I think this is important and pertinent is because, like, there needs to be some sort of money in the game, flesh in the game, skin in the game, when it comes to money, investing, etc. And I think the primary issue at hand now is. like money is actually yeah yeah search me eric kim e-r-i-c-k-i-m on youtubes what do you do i talk about like money working out finance bitcoin stuff like that okay. we i talk about uh, how to be happy too uh eric kim e-r-i-c last name kim like kim kardashian because i want the booty see you later thank you um, yes, so what are you talking about? Oh, so the problem with fiat currency is that it's backed by nothing, just the faith of the US government. And philosophically and ethically, the only reason why the US dollar has supremacy is because of our military. So everyone's like, okay, don't listen to any of these like people who have TikTok, right? But they're like, oh, you know. Rothschilds, evil Jewish banking corporation, blah blah. Is I'm like, no, you, you guys are fools. I mean, the 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 best way to think about it is uh, essentially Israel, right? Which was you know created by the help of the U.S. government. Uh, it would not be able to exist without the U.S. government, right? Even Seoul, South Korea, South Korea in general, essentially like military outpost, neo-colony of America. Uh, since the IMF bailout, even the IMF International Monetary Fund, essentially it's all in the US dollar, right? And what is fiat currency, faith currency backed by? Faith, faith in the US government that we continue to be the, the big, uh, the big wee wee on the planet, right? And, but then the problem is, the only reason why everything is packed to the dollar, including the Chinese Yuan, people who's like, China's gonna take over and we're all gonna be famous. I'm like, no, no, we're not. Like, ain't nobody gonna learn Chinese or Mandarin way too hard. Um, you know, the reason why English as a protocol has dominated is, you know, everyone has an iPhone, you could type it out. Even my theory why Vietnam has done so well internationally in terms of trade is because uh, Thing Viet, you know, the Vietnamese language is essentially by the Portuguese uh, missionaries. Essentially, it's like a Roman alphabet thing. So you could actually use an English keyboard to text in or write in, you know, Vietnamese without the accent marks. And people could still understand, which is super interesting. Uh, Good luck doing that with any other language. And even now, slowly but surely, you see like, even Koreans are using more and more English, uh, South Koreans, and English is still the world's dominant business language. So yeah, learning, knowing English is uh, important. Uh, and also coding, it's all in English, right? So yeah, good luck. Um, and so as long as your property value is in US dollars, as long as you have JP Morgan Bank, Chase America, 
uh, Bank of America is, as long as your salary is in US dollars or euros or whatever, right? Which is essentially pegged to the US dollar. Um, effectively, yeah, we're all kind of on it. So, I mean, in some funny ways, the, the ethical standard is actually to buy Bitcoin because it's censorship proof, it's tamper proof, it's not backed by our government, it's just backed by computing power and cryptography and maths, right? And it's open source. Like, I mean, we all believe in open source. Uh, why don't we, you know, invest in the ultimate open source money? Good morning. Um, so as a consequence, what I ethically believe in is by investing in Bitcoins, you're investing in freedom, suckers. And obviously, Bitcoin is not real money. But then again, is fiat currency is the US dollar. You can't, you can't uh, be on a desert island and eat your $100 bill to keep you alive, right? So yeah, I mean, obviously nothing is real. I mean, the Kanye is like, money ain't real, time ain't real, right? So nothing is really real. Like even a gold bar, can you eat your gold bar? Can you King Midas yourself? No. Um, so essentially what that then means is Money is essentially a man-made concept, which is only useful to us based on how we value it, right? So the question is, is the internet valuable? Yeah, but it's not real. You can't see it. The cloud, cloud computers, Salesforce, stuff on the cloud. Of course it is, right? Like it has value, right? And so I think the hard thing with uh, Bitcoins and technology, internet, etc., right? is it's it's not really tangible like you cannot touch the internet you cannot touch google you cannot touch youtube right we know it exists right so bitcoin's the same way right we're taking analog power from you know the real world uh we're creating the bitcoins it lives in cyberspace forever now it's hard to imagine 21 billion bitcoins in cyberspace because you know we can't see it right we can see a bar of gold we can see a stack of hundred dollar bills right but once again, like, I think the hard thing is trying to think creatively and trying to think about, uh, um, you know, digital cyber things, right? So even like photography, digital photography, good morning. Um, you know, your iCloud library, your iPhone, right? It's all in the digital realm, right? But, you know, it's like, is digital valuable? Yes, obviously, right? like all your passwords are on the iCloud chain or what is now, right? So yeah, just so just to think to yourself, just because it's digital cyber doesn't mean it's not valuable. Uh, Bitcoin might be the most valuable plant thing in the human universe.